Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And um, so I am back with uh, some stuff that I started in my last video. Last video was basically a first impressions, and so this video is actually going ahead and getting in to. A couple of the gift sets I got over at Alta and the new palette that I got and doing some swatches and just sort of uh, getting more than a first impression. So let's go ahead and get started and I'll start with what I have on today. Um, I did use the Revolution Skin Silk, mixed it with the ColourPop and this is the Liquid Lights, so this is one of their highlighters. And then I also mixed in a little bit of the Milani Conceal and Perfect, the bronzing drop. So I went ahead and mixed all three of these to go ahead and get my uh, foundation base today. And then as far as what I did for, let's see, I don't have any bronzer on right now, but we can kind of change that. So this is the MAC and this Light Radiant Mercy Bronzer. And let's see if I can find a brush here. Uh, go. So this one, the Real Technique ones, and it doesn't have a name on it. There we go with Light Radiant Rosy. And so that is now all applied all over everywhere. So bronzer is going to be MAC Light Radiant Rosy. And then as far as the blush, I have the Thanks on. And this one is by ColourPop. It's one of their liquid ones. Um, Let's see what else I have on here. Uh, to, to do highlighter, it's going to be the Mesmerize, and this one is by um, Rare Beauty. So that's what I have on there. And then as far as what I went ahead and did on the eyes, I went ahead and used the Essence and the uh, Make Me Brow. I did also use the Panorama by uh, L'Oreal and the Volume Stylist and this one is by Essence. So this is what I have on for the brows and the mascara. And going ahead and getting into the sets. One of the first sets that I got over at Ulta was the Joy Bright and this is the After Hours set. It has three blushes in them and yes it does look a lot like the Merit blushes so this is the way that the blushes look. As far as a swatch, um, so this one, this one, and this one are going to be the blushes. And so that's how they went ahead and swatched a lot of pigment. And they have some sheen and shine to them. The other thing that I got, and again, Joy Bright is new to me at my Alta. Um, usually they have the Shimmers group come in during the holidays and some other ones, but um, Beauty Creations comes in too a lot. But this Joy Bright was new to me. So um, they had a Right now over at Alta, you can buy one Joy Bright set and get another one half off. So I went ahead and picked up their lipstick set as well. And this is the way that the lipstick set looks. Um, I did go ahead and those are the lipsticks right there that I went ahead and swatched. And yeah, my swatches are different. Um, so, sorry about that. So I actually have on this one. And then I put a little bit of the um, Metaglow by Essence over the top, so I had these two on. So I thought it turned out really pretty. I didn't have any problem with it. And so these are two of the sets that you can get over at Ulta. Uh, these sets usually run between about 8 to $16 right now. Uh, they're on a buy one, get one half off, so that's fun. And then as far as what I did for the eyes, um, I did swatches that as well. So um, Inslee Rain has gone ahead and started their Black Friday sales. 
and they have um, a sale going on right now and that's what I ordered from and these are uh, this is flutter and this is flutter yeah and uh, the other palette is called flourish flutter is one that I picked up and it actually has more of the muted colors where flourish is going to be much more of a neon sort of bright sort of I would say more of a summery kind of palette but this is flutter I have that on today and so I did go ahead and pick it up in their sales and I really like the fact that they go ahead and they give you the collector boxes to go ahead and go with the palettes and their artwork is always so pretty and um, their palettes always have a lot of weight to them so they feel really luxe and it's really nice and so this is the palette I did uh, this is my second eye look with it and what I did today was I went ahead and used uh, this shade and I did watch a couple of um, videos where they said that this shade is more of a dark green rather than um, and actually in the viewfinder it is looking a little bit more green um, I could swear it looked more of a charcoal when it went on my eye but I went ahead and did that in the outer corner here and then I did go ahead and use golden hour on the lid and golden hour I think is a holographic one um, it has all the different color of glitters in it and then I did go ahead and use this one and that's what I have right on the brow here but I'm going to add a little bit more of that in so um, this is the way that the eye look came out and yeah I'm thinking that that golden hour is actually a holographic um, multi-chrome because it has all different colors of glitter in it and it's coming up as all sorts of different colors so I'm really thinking that this one is a holographic shadow and that's lovely because I love holographic shadows I think they're really pretty and they give off a special kind of sh shimmer that only they give off so I'm um, really glad I picked up this palette I may be picking up a couple more because they're just the quality is amazing in this line and so um, yeah I went ahead and used the Handy Eye in, um, Eyeliner to go ahead and go with it. But like I said, I think it's a holographic shadow. So I think you could probably put any sort of eyeliner, any color that you wanted to with it, because it'll pick up that color, because it has all sorts of different colors of glitter in there. And um, again, their multi-chromes are absolutely gorgeous. You don't need water to go ahead and activate them. Um, their mattes are easily blendable, and they have a ton of pigment in them. And so, yeah, this is just a really beautiful kind of eyeshadow to work with. So I'm really glad that I picked this one up. I may be picking up more, like I said. Um, and... Uh, so here are the swatches again and here are the swatches of the eyeshadow palette see this one is it's kind of coming off as a green but i swear in the pan it looks really really it looks like a charcoal to a really dark black and so i guess it is a dark green um but these are just fun colors to play with um the other multi chromes are just as pretty and so this is uh, what I've come up with as far as a look today and I think it kind of worked out fun and um, other than that I think uh, that's a video and I hope that you have a great day and um, be careful out there doing the um, Black Friday Cyber Monday thing that can be scary so uh, have a great day and I'll see you later bye